world that doesn't play by your rules. And like it or not, you and your friends are a part of it now. I don't have friends. I got family. Uh, the Fast and Furious franchise, do you yeah. think that it will be the longest one after James Bond? I think we concentrate on letting Fast 7 come out, see how well it does, if people like it, and they want to come back for another one, and they want us to come back for another one, then maybe we'll make eight. <laughs> That's a great question. That's a great question. I think that... I think that there is a lot of gas in the tank. You know, it's looking like it, you know. Um, but we're not a comic book, and we're not a TV show. So we're an original franchise, and we're rocking. Man, you never know. I think the fans will dictate that of how many more, you know, that we're going to do, because it just continues to get bigger and better. If that is what destiny calls for, um, there's so much rich story. Um, before the tragedy, I had mapped out three stories, seven, eight, and nine. And James Bond keeps getting made, by the way. It's gonna be hard to catch up. The most important thing in life will always be the people right here, right now. That's what's real. Is this the most important movie you've done, as it turned out? Hands down. I, I think it's the most important movie Hollywood has done in some ways, and definitely the most important movie that Universal has done, definitely the most important movie that I have done. I think it's very important because his fans get to see the last thing he did, and, and he's so wonderful in the movie, and so I'm, I'm really happy for that. I mean, all of them matter, but none of them matter as much as this one. Um, he's an angel, and he's with us. I think it's it's... It's definitely, it's something that no one that worked on this film has ever dealt with. The lines that it crosses, which is reality and film fantasy, are so blurred in this experience, both in the making of the movie and in the watching of the movie. So while you're interviewing me, I want Paul to be on everyone's mind constantly, because none of us want to be here today. You know, it's very hard for us to do interviews and press and show the world that we're excited about this movie um, when we all know what's really going on. So we're professional, we have a job to do, and uh, it still doesn't make it easy, so. We got mercenaries after us with enough weapons to wipe out small countries. This right here takes crazy to a whole nother level.